Welcome to Ill Informed with Mikey and Ethan. This week's guest, Chris Meyer of Sector 67. Chris Meyer, yes, Sector sir. 67, Madison, Wisconsin. A bunch of nerds in one big house. That's actually a pretty good description. And thank you very much for welcoming us in. Absolutely, it's been a pleasure to have you. This is how this works. We ask some questions. Uh, Ethan never prepares. I actually did prepare this time. What? Yeah, but I, I, don't, I don't get any of it. So it doesn't really matter. Uh, yeah. <laughs> So you're a self-proclaimed hacker. Yeah. Your t-shirt told me that. That's, yep, it's right on the back. <laughs> Tell me this, what's my password? Ooh, that one I am not a hacker of. So hack is really taking something and applying it in a way it wasn't intended. So nothing to do with computer stuff necessarily, it's everything to do with taking anything and solving a problem with it. So it could be you're going out on a date or something you need to figure out some kind of a belt and you don't have any belts. So phone wire, hose, string, whatever, that's your impromptu hacked belt. So that's hack in the, in the proper term. What if the problem that you had to solve was, you don't know my password? Then I'd be hacking your password, absolutely. Yeah, there, there we, we go. go. You know what it is? It's out there, no, not yet. I've been working on it though. It's my, oh, sorry. When you first started this, you needed 67 members, if I'm, if, correct me if I'm wrong. Yep, if I wanted to get paid anything to do all this cool stuff, then we had to find 67 members. Did seven actually eight nine? Yes, it did. What did Why? it taste like? Like raspberry pie. You holding any, any, any pie in this place? Is it? I, we got nothing, only on pie day. Then we're like flush. What, what day, day is, is pie day? day? March 14th. Uh, all right, Chris. So you think you're so smart. I don't, I've never advertised that point the whole time. Oh, he didn't say advertise, he said think. So you think. don't think you're so smart? I don't think so. I'm gonna ask... I don't wanna know. Two We're questions. Good. good. Okay, it's electric. I think it's a proclamation. Incorrect. <laughs> I think the correct answer, and everyone knows this, is... Dun 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 The correct answer is boogie woogie woogie. How do you not know that? You don't even know the answer to the question you It's the electric slide. What's the boogie woogie woogie? Pins, answer the question. It's electric. Boogie, woogie, 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 and you know it's there. Yeah, no. Can we afford the electric slide? Okay, stop doing, stop doing it. it. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe I should ask a different question. I'm not doing the electricity shop. Okay, what can this pull? Oh, yeah, we got that. Yeah? Big cars. We tried pulling the bus, though, one time. I didn't move that. All it's right. going to turn into a robot someday, but it hasn't grown up to that yet, so. This but you guys you guys do a lot of robotics, you make a yeah, lot of yeah, stuff? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We have a, the, the room and the building isn't big enough for it, but we have two six-axis robotic arms. What's the exit strategy? When, they, when the, the robots take over? Yeah, yeah that's, uh, you know, I'm worried about the tank that you guys built. Second question. Second question. Give it time. <laughs> if I have a pint glass, actually no, let's change this up. Let's say it holds four liters. We should really be on the metric system. And then I have two glasses in front of you. One holds three liters, one holds five liters, yep. and you have an infinite amount of beer. I need four liters exactly. How do you do it? I once, I once interviewed for Google and they asked stupid questions like this. So he asked the questions like, you got this much beer and this much beer, like what's the solution? Drink it all. Yeah. Or like, you, you need to give this guy three ounces and this guy five ounces. I'm like, I'm just gonna buy another pitcher. <laughs> <laughs> like, I think everybody wins in that scenario. I got a question for you guys. Hit me. Glass half full, glass half empty. Glass <laughs> in my belly. <laughs> Chris Meyer, thank you so much for joining us in the studio. And thank you very much for telling the robots to chill while we're here and to wait to commence the apocalypse till after we leave. Awesome. Thank you very thank much. Thank you. Chris, it's been a pleasure. It's been a blast. This has been Ill Informed on Wayward Nation. I don't know if my insurance coverage is high enough for you guys in here for too much longer.